Before jumping into what foods can heal muscle pain, let's briefly talk about what causes it. Myalgia, muscle aches and pains, can occur in any age group but is usually not life-threatening. It is very common, and everyone has or will experience it at some point. Muscle pain can occur in any area of the body since muscle tissues are widespread. In most cases, the pain can be treated without medical attention, but sometimes it may suggest an underlying condition. Muscle pain, or myalgia, can result from overuse, injuries, stress, infections, chronic conditions like fibromyalgia, certain medications, electrolyte imbalances, autoimmune diseases, and poor blood circulation. Foods for Healing Muscle Pain 1. Cottage Cheese Cottage cheese is a popular post-workout snack among athletes and gym goers. It is a great source of casein, a slow digesting protein that helps to reduce muscle soreness while asleep. With 23 grams of protein per cup of cottage cheese, casein has been reported to boost muscle synthesis in athletes overnight. Cottage cheese is also abundant in leucine. The amino acid important for building and maintaining muscle. Cottage cheese can be eaten with yogurt, fruits, and nuts, or used to make creamy smoothies or to increase the protein content of baked goods. 2. Watermelon Watermelon is a sweet and refreshing tropical fruit that is packed full of water and nutrients. Its high water content makes it excellent for improving hydration and reducing dehydration. Especially during muscle soreness. Watermelon is also rich in vitamin C, which helps reduce inflammation. A study on athletes found that drinking watermelon juice, including the rind, after exercise helped balance heart rate. Quicker and reduced post-exercise muscle soreness. This benefit is attributed to the high content of L-citrulline present in watermelon juice. Watermelon can be enjoyed on its own in smoothies or on crunchy salads. 3. Eggs Eggs are an excellent source of high biological value protein, meaning that the protein in eggs is easily absorbed by the body. We all know that protein is essential for building and maintaining muscles. So it shouldn't come as a surprise that consuming protein-rich foods such as eggs after intensive exercise may help reduce the chances of getting delayed onset muscle soreness. More importantly, eggs contain leucine, an essential amino acid that has been proven to stimulate muscle protein synthesis. 4. Bananas Bananas are an excellent source of potassium, a mineral that has potential benefits in reducing exercise-related muscle soreness. Eating a banana before exercising can help to prevent muscle cramps, which gets rid of the need to ease post-exercise muscle pain. The recommended daily potassium intake is 3,500 mg per day. Although many Americans don't meet this recommendation, it's easy to include bananas in your diet, just add them to smoothies, breakfast oats, on their own, or with peanut butter as a quick snack. 5. Turmeric It seems like turmeric can just about cure everything. Research has found that the curcumin component of turmeric may reduce the pain associated with DOMS and other injuries and speed up muscle recovery. Turmeric makes a great addition to breakfast oats, teas, smoothies, coffee, and turmeric latte, also called golden milk a combination of milk, turmeric, and ginger. 6. Coffee Speaking of coffee, coffee has been shown to significantly reduce post-exercise muscle pain when consumed an hour before exercising. Be careful not to overdo it though, about a cup or two of coffee will do the trick. Foods that can help with muscle pain are not always the ones you'd expect. The foods listed above provide a range of nutrients to help fight muscle pain in different ways. Some work by increasing circulation or reducing inflammation, while others improve nerve function or promote better sleep quality. It is important to remember that these items may be more beneficial when paired with other treatments such as physical therapy, rest breaks, massage therapy, and stretching exercises. If your myalgia persists after trying these suggestions for some time, it would be worth chatting with a medical professional to get an accurate diagnosis.